Welcome to our new home. Oh man. All right, we are in one of the units. There are three two bedroom, one baths, and one, one, one. So I'm gonna give a tour of the unit that we're staying in. And then I can go down to the one that my sister and brother-in-law are in. Um, there's a lot to do. There's a lot really today to just move out of here because there's so much stuff, so much furniture and old, weird, odd things. So that's our focus because our stuff comes today too. Mini moves came or is coming very, very soon, which I'm very happy about just to have some of our own stuff in here. Um, but let me give you a little tour of this room. It's great stuff. Okay, home sweet home. This is it. I mean, I, there's not much to say. You know, you know what I feel. You know how I'm feeling. You know how I feel about every picture is crooked too. Every single picture, and there's a lot of pictures, and all of them are crooked. And my brother-in-law is like, I've gone over them to them and tried to correct all of them and make them all straight, but they're all still crooked. So, okay, so all this is coming out. I'm emptying out the cupboards. Um, um, this is one of the kitchens in here so we're doing all new appliances all new cabinet faces gonna rip out the island part of this um there's the beach right there and go down it has a great little layout though we'll be replacing the floor here the bathroom all gonna re be redone um shells galore and one of the bedrooms and one of the other bedrooms which is identical we're gonna make both of the bedrooms king size beds just so if couples come um whatever we just feel like it's gonna be more functional so i'm gonna start going through all of this and bringing a whole bunch of this stuff down so when the movers get here i can bring it up and then i'll show you guys the rest of the place all right we've already got a bunch out of here the kitchen's done uh we'll keep the sofa in here to use that but i'm gonna move my own rugs in here my own table and chairs so there's kind of two things going on at once. We're making this one feel like home while also clearing it out. We'll start to kind of do things we can in here while working on the other units. But this just goes to show you can make any space feel like home without like painting or ripping things out. So that's my goal for the next three months, just to make it feel like us. I really thought you were gonna go over the edge with it. Hey bro, am I safe? Am I safe to trust this? Uh oh. Wait, no, wait, I have an idea. I did this with the other one. Um, no. <gasps> a lot of weird things in this house. This thing has been freaking us out. It's a little voodoo contraption. I think they had some little things hanging on it. Some little, uh, Getting all that nonsense out of there. This, this light, the cheese light, looks like a mouse trap. Okay, I want to answer a few questions. So we moved to Florida. People are a little confused and I just want to clear it up. Our house in northern california we still own it but it's up on airbnb we're deciding what we're going to do with it but for now it's up on airbnb um we are living here at the inn while we renovate it so we'll renovate the three units and then live in the fourth unit and then we'll renovate the fourth unit and we'll move out and we're moving somewhere around here not sure where so let me show you under the two upper units the space i love so there's two units right here. This is ours. The other one's over there. You can go up to it. And then there's this space here. So the two units, and then there's another spot where the other two units are. And I'll show you that after. But under here is this garage space. I just think is so cool. And I want to read. So there's an entrance. There's windows in here. There's an entrance on this side. So you can come from down the stairs or there's an entrance <clears throat> right here. We're going to go to that area next. You can get to the other side. And the coolest part about it is to transform this and make a little window out to the pool area so if you're out by the pool and you want to like order a coffee or a drink you can just come right to the window like a little drink service right there ah! all right we got the other two units right here my sister-in-law is in this one and then the pool is back on this side and then the upper units are behind and that's the garage space i was just at Okay, so this one's really big too and it's kind of weird the way it's like laid out but has a living space a kitchen um ooh, light it's good stuff um bedroom so this one will be the only two bedroom that has two twins in it so if the family wants to stay here i may even be able to fit three twins um and then the other part of the kitchen and then you can put a king in here and the bathroom 
And then this actually goes out to the pool area also, which we have lots of things to do here and definitely will be hitting up yards in for this. Okay, so this is my sister-in-law, Lynn. This is Dino's sister. And, oh, hey, Brian, creeping in there. The Brian, the baby holder. Um, so Lynn is gonna be the property manager. Bri will be the baby holder. No, he's going to be official. Doing, he's the new Jerry, basically, and pastor of the new church that they're going to be starting here. Which cannot wait for that. Uh, one one unit, and they kind of did a little bit of work in this one. There is like some molding there done. This one has the cool floor, which is great. They did this. Although we will be replacing this all. I mean, we'll keep probably the structure, but it's all going to get redone because the rooms are all going to have their own themes, and I can't wait to share what that is. Definitely going colorful, Florida feel. Well, old sign is down. So there you go. That's definitely a fire hazard. All the kids are like, what is happening? Ugh, yucky. This is what I was trying to get into earlier. This is the space in between the two lower. This is the garage coffee shop. The two uppers are there. But this is an, a screened area, and I'd love, obviously, to just make this a really cool hang area. Put a little garden out here. So, really, really happy we used Mini Moves to not have to pack anything, to not have to load anything. They're doing it all is, like, incredible. And they specialize in the small moves. So, state to state, they pack it, ship it. I'm really excited about this. We have not been able to ride our Blue Jay bikes because we lived in the mountains all over the island and we are going to be getting two more for the inn so that when guests come they can just sign them out and ride with the electric bikes i got my little helper this is really great they so they listed everything on the boxes and then can we just talk about how nice it is if everything is wrapped up like perfectly just perfectly oh, it's amazing i would never have done this it just feels good okay we have our table and chairs in here movers are done they're so fast Took some of the open shelving off so I could just feel like us a little bit. Do you guys want to hear the name of the inn? Should we share the name, babe? Let's do this. Go put the sheets on our bed, you know, our yellow sheets so they're comforter, just so it feels like us. Obviously, that headboard has to stay because it's amazing. And then we're basically unpacked. And then I'm going to take a photo and share the name of the inn. Gabby is just Foxy's little, um, what's that called? Jester? Jester. Jester, huh? You just make her laugh so much. Yeah. You're gonna laugh? Gabby, make her laugh. Make her laugh. <laughs> Who needs a workout program when this, you just drag this baby in the sand. Anything in the sand is a lot.